I have retrieved your children. And Hello, finally, Tusker. Hello, Master Kratos. What you've accomplished for these realms is truly something I never thought possible. Uh, rest assured, good Master Brock would be proud beyond measure, even if only to express it in his love language of profane non sequiturs. Ah, but he is terribly missed. Yes, he is. Now, there is one rather interesting development to apprise you of. The detonation of Asgard shook the world tree to its very roots, dislodging a great number of realm seeds. I thought you might wish to have them. My little way of saying, thank you for preventing my death by immolation. You are welcome. But putting all that aside for the moment, is there anything else? Seems we met another of your detachable emotional apparitions. Bit too twitchy to tell us his name. <laughs> ah, you must mean anxiety. Oh no. Why are you talking about me? What did I do? Oh, you should have heard the shit they were talking. Sad. What? Oh dear, oh dear. There was no such talk. Shame on you, bitter. Are you sure? We are leaving. Ah, a busy man, I see. Don't let me keep you. Alternate lyrics to my ballads. Absolutely disgusting. <laughs> uh, but now I wish I could remember some of them. Oh, the paperwork that man created for me. I had to build a chest just for his violations. A big one. I taught him 20 different ways to cold forge a bolster. <laughs> Once. He taught me a slightly easier method of wire pulling, and from that day on, called me his apprentice. <laughs> a true asshole he was. Gods, I'm gonna miss him. Hi. Y'all made it. Just about to send him off. I have met many on my travels. You are one of the few I would call friend. I always thought you were one of the dumbest creatures I'd ever met. Didn't expect you to be the bravest, too. This world is a darker place for your leaving it. We're taking him to the Sphered Sands. It's, uh, in the wetlands near the ferry. We'll wait for you there.
What is wrong? I should have changed, sewn some mourning garb, or not dressed properly. We're fine. The dwarves don't typically require formal wear at funerals. Brock certainly would not. Perhaps. So, now you've got me thinking of what I might look like with some jewelry around my neck stump. Maybe some gold woven into my beard. That'd be quite fetching, eh? <laughs> Thanks for trying. There they are, brother. Oh, come on, surely he'll be along. It's his brother. Let's hope so. Loss can do things to a man. You made it. We can begin.
a hole. What? Gets bigger the more you take away. <laughs> 